Hi guys, what's up? My name is David and welcome back to my channel. So as you may or may not see, it's brighter in here and that's because for the first time I'm filming during the day and not at 10pm as always. So yeah, let's start. So in this video I want to talk about work, working as a trans person. So I currently have two jobs, I work at the supermarket and I work in a food delivery service and I have been working at the supermarket for about a year and two months and I have been working at the food delivery service for one week. <laughs> so the most stressful thing as a trans person at work is of course applying for a job because it, unless you have already ch legally changed your name you have to apply with your birth name which is not fun. I actually did not do that. I just applied as my chosen name and then during the job interview I just said hey by the way I know that you will need my personal information and my ID and I just want to tell you that the name on my ID is not actually the name I use in day-to-day -day life so I would prefer you not using that name and only just using it for the stuff it has to be used for. So yeah, when I got my name tag, I got a name tag with my chosen name and they, everyone knows me as my chosen name. They know I'm trans because I am really open about it, I don't want to be stealth. But other than that, it's perfectly fine, I don't see my birth name everywhere, it's just in the system because that's how I'm legally known, so they have to put that in their system, but other than that, it's perfectly fine. And with my new job at the food delivery service, I also applied with my chosen name, but they asked me to, you know, send a scan of my ID and then I also had to tell them that, listen, the name on my ID will not correspond with the name I actually use because I'm trans, blah blah blah. So people don't make a fuss about it, especially in the Netherlands, but it's just it's very in irritating that you always have to state that, by the way, I'm trans, I use a different name, and you can just work there and have nobody ask any questions. So yeah, you always have to out yourself at some point, which is not great. And another part of working as a trans person is, of course, people misgendering you. So I work at the supermarket and often customers have to ask me a question. And for some reason, a lot of people just always use gendered greetings. They just say, hey, miss, do you know where the bread is? And I just don't understand why you feel the need to add that, especially when I have a name tag that says David, which is a male name, if you did not know. But yeah, customers don't bother looking at someone's name tag, they just want to know where the bread is. Now please have bread. <laughs> but yeah, I just, I just don't understand why it's so hard to just say excuse me or hey, do you know where a certain product is? It, it's, it's, it's not great when people misgender you, and, but on the other hand, it's fun when people gender me correctly when they ask me, sir, do you know where a certain product is? Or when they don't use a gendered greeting towards me, I'm fine with that too. Just don't, don't, don't say miss, I just, no. Um, and in the food delivery service it's great because, you know, you don't really have to talk to anyone, you just pick up an order and bring someone their food and you're like, hey, here you go. You don't have to tell anyone your name or your gender or anything and that's just amazing. So if you're trans and you're looking to find a job, it's fine to apply with your chosen name, I guess. Uh, and it really depends on where you live and who the person is that you're going to have an interview with. Because I just, I was lucky to have a very accepting manager, but I know that that's not the case everywhere. So just watch out with what you do. And if someone does not accept your identity, then just don't don't accept the job and go work somewhere else because you don't want to get misgendered constantly and work in an environment where you don't feel like you can be yourself. So I work in one of one of the big supermarket chains in the Netherlands and the people I know that also work in one of their shops who are trans also had no problem with getting the right name tag and getting um, gendered correctly, but if you are someone who has a negative experience with any workspace, comment down below because 
I am curious and I also want to know where not to work in the future. <laughs> so yeah, today is kind of a short video. I don't have much to say, but I think I've informed you enough about the topic. And please comment down below what other topics you would like me to talk about because I am going to run out of ideas at some point. So uh, yeah, please, please, please. <laughs> Anyways, thank you for coming to my TED talk and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!